Hi everyone, Happy New Year. I'm Book Club Mom and I just wanted to check in with you and see how you're doing. I have a couple things that are new. First of all, it is New Year's Eve. We don't have big plans. So uh, my plan is that I'm making a beef stew because New Year's Eve, you know, that's an exciting meal to have. Um, I thought I'd dress up a little bit for the occasion though. So uh, yeah, I wanna show you my bling. And, um, but uh, let's see, I hope everybody had, if you celebrated Christmas, you had a nice Christmas, or if you were celebrating Hanukkah or Kwanzaa, um, that you had a nice time too. So today I'm gonna just tell you about a couple things. One of them is, first of all, you might not realize this, but I got myself, and I can't show it to you because my phone is on it, but I got a new, this little tripod with bendy legs and a remote. So I uh, see the remote. And um, so I can start and stop my videos. And uh, so that's really an upgrade for me. So you're not gonna see my arm come out when I'm ending the video. So I'll just be clicking on my remote. A uh, couple of things that are going on. Um, I am reading The Name of the Rose by Umberto Eco. And um, it is really hard. I um, have to read it for work. Our mystery book club is reading it. and. It's good, it's just really hard. So you can't rip through a book like this. So I don't have to, uh, my book group doesn't meet for, um, it's the third week in January, so I decided I better start early. So I committed to reading 50 pages a day. So this is day two, I'm on on page 100, but it takes a long time to even read 10 pages. So um, uh, I know this is, it's called A Brilliantly Conceived Adventure Into Another Time an intelligent and complex novel, a lively and well-plotted mystery. It takes place in the 1300s, so um, in an abbey. So we'll see. You'll be hearing from me about that later in the month, probably. So this is the first time I've ever done this, but I am reading another book at the same time I'm reading this because this is work. I, most of the time when I read a book for work, it's um, easy but this one's work. So I'm reading, I downloaded a book on my Kindle. It is, just started it. It's called, it's a thriller. And I know everybody, a lot of people have already read it. Behind Her Eyes by Sarah Pinborough. So it's going to be a nice, that will be easy to get through. So, but I have this problem because I take notes in this thing. And with this book, I started on the next open page and I've already taken so many notes that uh, I had to guess how far out to start my other book with notes. So I just took a big chunk of paper and, and I'm going to start further in. So that's boring, sorry. Um, other than that, nothing else is really going on. I'm coloring. I just got off the phone and I was coloring. And so I did a little bit of this. I mostly worked on that tree. So, oh, and here's something. So my sister sent me a whole bunch of library socks. So today I'm wearing these, which um, are very fun. I got them all in library uh, or uh, rainbow of colors. So I have like pink, green, yellow, um, blue. And then there's one other color. I can't think of what it is, but I was gonna show you the whole pack, but then I started wearing them. And so, um, and then I went for a walk and my feet got soaked because um, I walked up the hill behind our house and uh, the grass was really tall. So I had to change my socks. So now I only have the yellow ones left before I do wash. So, so that is pretty much it. Um, I'm going to show you at the end of this, I did a little, um, a lot of cooking at Christmas. And uh, so last week, I made a lasagna and so I was just fiddling around with my phone. So I'm gonna show you uh, what I did at the end, just as an experiment. So if you liked it, that's great. So anyway, um, I hope you're all doing well. And if you go out tonight that you have a fun time. Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider following me. Uh, that would be great. Um, but otherwise I will talk to you again real soon.